I think the big thing is just having the confidence to know that she can go back, um, that she can qualify again. Um, certainly when you go through an experience like qualifying for nationals, you always want to be go back. You don't want to be left at home the next year. So I think it's, it's added a little bit more motivation to the season. I would say the conference is going to be very good again. Uh, both Cornerstone and Aquinas finished in like the top 15 in the nation last year. Um, they should be probably pretty similar this year. I think we'll be a lot better and I know Indiana Tech has added some pieces so they should be really good as well. Should be a tough conference. Uh, well, Cam is kind of the, the outright leader of the team um, just in uh, personality and, and how he carries himself. He's run, been running really well in practice so far. We've done some workouts where he's run 30, 40 seconds faster than he did a year ago. Um, and Dustin is just solid. Uh, Dustin is just a grinder. He'll just get out there and work every day. And, and uh, Brandon George is right on his heels as well. Uh, we got one newcomer with some experience, Mason Prisby, who is from right here in Caledonia, went to Caledonia High School, but he's a transfer from Wisconsin Parkside, so he brings a, a year of experience of running uh, at the college level. Uh, we also have two um, freshmen that I think will surprise some people, um, Travis Sobsky and Cody Freeman from Granville High School. One of our main team goals this year is one to be to be nationally ranked and the way our ranking systems go, um, we have to go race NAI schools and prove that we're better than them. Uh, in the past we've run a lot of teams in Michigan and maybe they're D1 or D2 uh, and, and because they're not known NAI wise maybe that hurt us so our schedule is really set up to race NAI people that's why we've you know, we're not going to Michigan Intercollegiate, we're going to the Bethel meet instead. We're going to um, a meet down in Louisville, which will have a lot of the Southern NAI teams there as well.